I'm in Flushing, Queens today for something called the Maker Fair, which you'll quickly realize is not your average science fair. Let's go in and take a look. Can I get your name? Dan Perone, maker of Tape Lake, otherwise known as UOCOD. So there's this thing that looks like a rock and um, there's a controller that you can manipulate the rock to move around on what? Uh, the surface is comprised of uh, cassette tape and there's a, a Walkman tape head mounted to the underside of this remote control car chassis and that tape head when driven across this uh, cassette tape picks up those sounds, or those magnetic signals and then turns it into, into sound, which you're hearing through the amplifier. So, so what is this? It is an airplane made from trash, mostly and it's called a towel and we have something that someone can build in about less than three hours two servos two bits of um, uh, what's that called coat hanger exactly um, plastic cardboard core plast, a little bit of velcro a speed controller this is a receiver this is a spare receiver it's, uh, it's got two receivers to sort of figure out which is the best signal this is a brushless motor that is uh, made in china they're very cheap and very good nice 10-4 prop big hole in the middle for the prop to go through. Without that hole, it doesn't fly very well. You can go to brooklynairdrome.com. We will have plan. We have plans and we have a build video and parts list and everything you need. And if you want to come build with us, we're in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, and we will have build nights and build days for the foreseeable future given how many people will come by. What is your name? Uh, hi, I am Samson. Uh, I am from Cooper Union. I'm a senior chemical engineering major, and I'm part of the ChemiCar team. It's an undergraduate competition where we have to design and build a car to go a specific distance. Um, this is our fuel cell. Uh, well, fuel cells unfortunately are not that cheap, so this costs us $800 to be purchased. For that small. Yeah, the motor is back here. It is geared to the wheels and the peristaltic pump. The peristaltic pump is what pumps the acid from the acid chamber into the uh, reaction chamber. Three years ago, actually, we won the national competition. So uh, we're going to try to do it again. I hope you guys win. That's very cool. What is your name? And tell me about your suit of armor. Uh, I'm Dr. Adventure, and this is my custom party armor from the New Flesh Workshop. Yeah. So what is um, the, the New Flesh Workshop do exactly? Uh, the New Flesh Workshop makes wearable gadgetry, custom prosthetic and orthotic devices, and party armor. Uh, party armor is light armor for extreme li lifestyles and uh, dumb fun stuff. This is our Wilderness Survival Gauntlet, uh, and this has a whole bunch of tech in it. Uh, this is straight Wilderness Survival. There's a sewing kit and a fishing kit. That's right here. There's a, a tinder kit, which is uh, for starting fire. Uh, we got a multi-tool with a compass and a flashlight. Uh, and then we also got a, an emergency signaling mirror. All my clothes rip, break, or get too dirty to wear again. I need stuff that will last me my whole life. The only thing you can do to really destroy it is melt it. So I can basically take this, bury it for a thousand years, all I gotta do is relace the thing and put it right back on. Which, by the way, you will absolutely be coming back in a thousand years. I, I know it, I can feel it. And you'll be wearing that. I'll be just fine. <laughs> Everybody, I'll fit in though, everybody else will be wearing it too, hopefully, yeah. So as you can see, this really is a science fair on steroids. Um, I also picked up some new best friends. Hi guys. Say goodbye, I'm Ellie Roundtree, and this has been Rocket Boom Tech. Awesome! <laughs> yeah!